All right, so in this video, we're going to talk about the unit circle and cast. And now, every math student learns cast at some point or some other variation of cast. Now, they do it by writing the letters C, A, S, T here. Now, why? Uh, I'll explain. So we're doing trig ratios at the moment, and we know that uh, this dot here is equal to cos theta and sine theta. And we also know that if we wanted to know the tan ratio, we'd just do tan theta equals sine theta over cos theta. All right, so cos theta, sine theta, and tan theta are all positive in that quadrant. So cos is a positive value, cos theta. Sine is a positive value because the x coordinate and the y coordinate in quadrant one is positive. And a positive divided by a positive is a positive. So all tan theta values would be positive in quadrant one as well. Now, what does this one mean? Well, let's consider a dot here. Cos theta, sine theta. Now this time, cos theta is the x-coordinate of this dot, which would be negative. So any value for cos theta is going to be negative here. Sine theta is our y coordinate, which is positive. And then think about tan theta. Uh, cos theta is negative. So a positive divided by a negative is a negative. So negative tan theta. Now, I started this video by saying we're talking about cast. All the um, trig ratios, cos, sine, and tan, all are positive in this quadrant. In this quadrant, only the sine ratio is positive. Now let's consider this one for a second. Put a dot here. Obviously that's cos theta sine theta. I'm probably going off the board there, but you get the idea. Cos theta is going to be negative. Sine theta is going to be negative because it's a negative y value, a negative x value. Now what about tan theta? It's going to be a negative divided by a negative, a negative divided by a negative. It's going to be a positive. C-A-S-T. This is the tan quadrant. Only tan um, ratios are positive in this quadrant. And finally, we have a dot here, which of course is cos theta sine theta. And in this quadrant, cos is the x-coordinate, which means that it's positive. x-coordinate's positive in that direction. Whoops. Sine is negative. And the tan ratio is going to be a negative divided by a positive, which is a negative. This is the C quadrant, the cosine quadrant. So, that's a quick way to figure out whether your answers are going to be positive or negative. We haven't actually done any work yet. I'm just telling you, this is cast. This is how you're going to be able to tell whether things are going to be positive or negative in each of the four quadrants. Let's get to work.